in, in Maryland, you got uh people in you got an organization that's called the BGF, right? But they they call him Jay. I don't know why they call him Jay. I never asked. Mm-hmm. But they call him Jay. They they predominantly in Baltimore. Yeah. But you would see a blood, right? Most of the time, I don't know how it is now, but and most of the time they at odds. BGF and Bloods? Yeah. And BGF Black Gorilla fam, right? Exactly. Okay. Exactly. You on point. So you would see a blood that may go over and, you know, become J, but you would never see somebody that's J, mm-hmm. BGF, become, yeah. go over the blood. So, like, if you swapping gangs and you didn't check out correctly, that will get you hit. Mm. And I, I, I've seen that happen multiple times. You know what I'm saying? I've seen that happen multiple times. So what, is it more so, because when I, I may hear, you know, stories about prison, say, California, where it's like... You do have, you know, gangs, bloods, and crips, but it's more so predominantly racially divided. Yeah. In the Maryland system, is it is it more so racially or gang divided? It's gang. Okay. It's gang. It's gang 100%. It's not even racially divided at all. Mm. But that's also what makes uh, Maryland, in my opinion, soft. Mm. Because when you have individuals that are tied to a gang, right? Yeah. Um, a lot of times they aren't really, they're doing it for protection, right? Mm-hmm. Whereas, whereas though, like you can't, you can't go into the federal system and say, oh, I want to identify as white now. Mm-hmm. You nigga, you're black. Right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. And you can't do that for the sake of protecting yourself, right? So like in, in the Maryland system, what you would do is this. A lot of people become Muslim, right? Obviously, this isn't the reason why I became Muslim. But you have a lot of people that would become Muslim because the Muslim is the majority. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So now they're trying to hide behind the Muslims yeah. for protection when the whole time you was blood in the county. You blood on the streets. Right. You know what I'm saying? But because you're at this uh, particular facility, mm-hmm. which may be JCI, MCIJ, now you want to be Muslim. Yeah. But the minute they send you out Eastern Shore or Cumberland, you blood again. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So, like, it's a lot of... You dealing with a a low-frequency sucker-ass nigga, bro. Yeah, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Like, jokers that go in the federal system, you can't do that. Yeah. So, a lot of people... And it's more racially divided, but it's also city divided in the ra- in the, in the feds. So, obviously, D.C., you know, they, 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 they run the federal system. Okay. D.C., and I'll probably say New Orleans. I've never been in the federal system, but from what my OGs have told me and from what I do know, mm-hmm. D.C. and New Orleans is up there. But the cities are more divided, but at the same time, they will still come together based upon race. Okay. So you're not going to just have a white boy jumping on or five white boys jumping on one black man. And don't think that, you know, going, somebody going to die. From another city, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. somebody going to die. It, it may be jokers from um, from Chicago, New Orleans, Baton Rouge, D.C., and Atlanta may all come together. They mm-hmm. may even be, have some, some be at odds, but they may all come together just to fight these white boys. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It'd it be like that. But in Maryland, pff, you'll never find that. So when you say federal, is that like, how does how does that work? Is it federal? Are you talking about in Maryland or are you talking about another location? Federal is like United States um, prison bureaus. Uh-huh. The Bureau of, uh, you know, federal prisons. So what you would have like in, in, what you have is basically in D.C., for example, there's, there's no state. Right. So when you get since and locked up in DC jail and convicted, mm-hmm. uh, you about to get shipped out. So they'll mm. ship, they might send you out to either FCI or USP, United States Penitentiary, mm-hmm. or a Federal Correctional Institute. Mm-hmm. Obviously, a penitentiary is worse. So depending on your charge and if you're like a violent criminal, yeah. you may get sent to the penitentiary. If not, you go into an FCI, like a camp. What's the difference between those? FCI is a lot more... Uh, Laid back, you're in a mm-hmm. cell. Most of the time in the penitentiary, you in a dorm. So it may be like 60 people, mm-hmm. maybe more, in one open space. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Um, most of the time. I, I believe there's some penitentiaries that do have like cells. I'm not too sure. Yeah. But um, that's the main difference. So like with the federal system, it's like 
people from everywhere. You're not mm -hmm. going to just run into people from Baltimore. You're going to see people from All over. L.A., yeah. uh, Minneapolis, Texas, mm -hmm. Detroit. You're going to see people from all over. Got you. You know? You're dealing with so many different characters, too. Yeah, yeah. You know? What was, while you were in prison, um, what was the worst, like, thing or instance you've seen while you were in? Mm. Whether you were a part of or not, because on your YouTube, you did do, you know, like prison stories or whatnot, yeah. and I tuned in to one that was more so, it was like about a, a, a like a gang fight, right? I mean, I've, I've been in, you know, won't call it a gang fight, because I've never been in a gang, but mm -hmm. I was in a, we were, we were- Group fights, I we was in a, We was in a gang, we was in a gang fight, you call yeah. it that, you know, it was, we was fighting the bloods, we was in a knife fight, but like, really 20 bloods, but mm -hmm. only five, but they only sent five of them on a mission to kill my man. Um. And obviously they were unsuccessful. So it was like it was like twenty of them, twenty of us. And by us, you mean Muslims? Yeah. But <laughs> this is why I tell you, like people can try to and become Muslim all you want. Muslims in the Maryland system, bro, they is not who you may think they are, bro. And this is just from my experience. Mm -hmm. You know what, what I'm saying? Mean? They soft. Mm. They soft. They they really soft. They'll fight you. They will fight you, meaning mm -hmm. another Muslim. Yeah. Before they fight somebody else, I've seen the biggest guy in the jail. Mm -hmm. This dude was Muslim, right? He would he would bark and yell all day. He'd never bite. Mm. This nigga was bigger than Refrigerator Perry. Mm. But That's when it's dude. time, when them knives come out, yeah. tuck his tail. Mm. So, like, I've been in knife fights with, with bloods. They try to kill my man. We got active. I got stabbed right here and then twice in my back. Once alongside my iliocostalis muscle, which is the muscle that protects the spine. Mm. So... Had I not been in shape, who knows? I could have been paralyzed. Yeah. But I had enough muscle fiber yeah. to slow down the penetration crazy. of a knife. A lot of people don't know, like, muscles su supply blood. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Well, blood is, yeah, muscles ha hold blood. Yeah. So if you get hit in a certain area, depending on how much muscle mass you have in that area, mm -hmm. can dictate if you'll survive or your recovery. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? How yeah. fast you'll be able to recover. Yeah. Same thing with gunshot wounds. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I know certain people that got hit 20 times and they survived. So is that like why Fifth got hit nine times and was able to... It's a, it's, it's, it's a high chance. Yeah, yeah. It's a high chance. Yeah. I mean, after, you know, the, 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 the bounty and the gift and the blessing of Allah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So that's a, that, that's a good point. I never thought of that. But yeah. yeah. So you were saying how you know in the maryland systems like the muslims maybe don't get as active is that because they ain't saying all of them yeah yeah for sure for sure for sure you're just saying you know some is that would that be more so just because it just ain't in them or maybe i don't know how this works in the muslim community maybe y'all don't re start the act of violence first so maybe like you more so focus on retaliation than starting it or maybe it's like I don't know. Is it as is it, it somewhat frowned upon? Like, how does that work? It, it depends. It's never frowned upon to defend yourself. I'm talking about not defending yourself. I'm start, talking about being a proactive one. Meaning on the offense. Yeah. I mean, sometimes you got to be on the offense mm -hmm. in order to protect yourself. Right. Because, like, say, for example, like, we knew they was trying to kill him. Mm-hmm. Nobody wanted to act first. Yeah. Oh, you know okay. what I'm saying? Nobody okay. wanted to act first. So consequently, we got hit. Mm -hmm. We got hit first. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, so that's why, that like, instance, you got to be on the yeah, offense that sometimes. Instance, yeah. You what, know what did they want to get at him for? They said that he was hot. They said he, he told. But my whole thing is how the hell is an individual locked up nine years uh -huh. and nothing, and he's been in general population for nine years. Nobody never touched him. Nobody never tried to kill him. Nothing. Mm -hmm. Where's the paperwork? Yeah. But, like, I did say... You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying that he's hot. Because I never, I still to this day never seen the paperwork. Mm -hmm. But to this day, I've never seen the paperwork. And individuals said that they saw it, but would never show me it. Mm -hmm. So everything happened so fast. They yeah. ain't show me it. And he said that he never made a statement. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I never, I never got the paperwork from him because leading up to it, like I said, things happen so fast. Yeah. If there is no investigating. You just got to react now. Yeah. But my whole thing was, how the hell do you get? How the hell is an individual in the system for nine years, four or five different prisons, mm -hmm. and 
Nobody never Nothing. shows the paperwork. Look, How does that work? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like I, I felt as though it was something more behind it. Mm, they just needed that scapegoat. But they used that as a scapegoat. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know what it could have been though. Could have been. Could have been drug related. Yeah. Could have been money related. Yeah. I don't know. 